Akiyoshi Door Cave is Japan's largest complex of limestone caverns. The groundwater system that created these magnificent caves is listed under the Ramsar Convention, the international standard for conservation and wise use of natural wetland resources. The plateau of Akiyoshi Dai is in western Japan, about an hour's drive from Yamaguchi City. As you cross this grassy highland, the landscape begins to fill with curious rock formations. A closer look at these limestone boulders reveals the fossil remains of ancient corals. A large coral reef was formed in the Pacific 350 million years ago. The movement of the ocean plates gradually pushed it onto the land, creating this limestone plateau. There are no rivers anywhere on the plateau, so where does the rainwater go? In a cast type landscape like this, surface water drains away through sinkholes. 100 meters below the plateau surface is the entrance to Akiyoshi Do, a huge cave formed by water eroding the limestone. You can explore a one kilometer section by yourself, and a guide will take you into more remote areas of the 10 kilometer cave complex. The rainwater drips down through the limestone into this cave. The lime in the water is deposited, hardening and slowly building to form stalactites and stalagmites. Each pool in this vast terrace has a rim of limestone, a wall built up by the gentle lapping of the waves. There are over 500 of these rimstone pools. No other cave in the world has such a large number. Rippled patterns on the towering golden pillar stalagmite reveal its origin as an underground waterfall. Our guide leads us away from the main course. She's found a three millimeter long shrimp. Evolving in the darkness, it has lost its eyes and become pure white. Among the cave's other living fossils are several ancient insect species. Why is this area listed by the Ramsar Convention? The Akiyoshi Dai Museum of Natural History is the place to find out. The huge underground water system of Akiyoshi Plateau created the caverns and a special kind of karst landscape that occurs in very few other places. This is an internationally important site for its scientific value as well as for its scenery. Both above and below ground, this unique landscape was created simply by the action of water and of time. 